Hey, good morning everyone. This is Ryan from Resell CMY. I got Paul and his daughter Kennedy behind me here. We're gonna pull some eBay orders. It's kind of a below average day again yesterday. We got 12 orders for $380.73. And we got a couple cool items in there though. Uh, this will be a quick video. I'm not gonna add too much to this because it's gonna be a short work day. It's Friday. Uh, we're gonna get these all jammed out and then I gotta prepare for a party at my house for tomorrow. So I got a bunch of yard work and stuff to do. I'm gonna bring her on a little daddy-daughter date since Ryan's doing that. What are you doing? Uh, I'm thinking about bringing her, I, mean, I know I'm gonna bring her to lunch, but I don't wanna say the other place in case it doesn't oh. go through it completely. Strip club. I don't club. wanna be held to it. Yeah, he Strip always. Strip club. Yeah. <laughs> Lost Horizon. No, I'm kidding. What is it, Dad? Yeah. Nothing, honey. So I'm now you're gonna hear her ask, <laughs> what is it, 27 more times in this video. Uh, yeah, so $380, 12 orders. Uh, the first one, Paul, is on EE. It's yep. gonna be a full length door size poster, 26 inches by 75 inches. This is of James Dean, vintage poster, uh, $40 plus shipping. I'm gonna show you a big screenshot right now because uh, Paul is gonna pull, uh, it's already tubed up and basically ready to ship. Just need some tape and a uh, label on it. Um, you want to set that on that table, honey? We do have a couple ornaments already pulled. Um, just so you know, our setup, if you haven't seen it before, for those large door size posters, or any posters really, is uh, we uh, use the back side of the garage door here in the shop. You can see this bunch of magnets there set up for it. But that screenshot you saw was set up right there. This actually works great. Uh, another benefit of using filing cabinets, you can also use magnets to do normal size posters on the sides of those, their side of those as well. So, what's next here, Paul? Oh, Donjo? D20. Uh, here. This, this might be the Donjo. last one. Yes, it is. So that's cool. I'm gonna make sure this one's not scratched up though. Yeah, the last one we had, the guy said was scratched up, so we're gonna check this one out real quick. This is a Donjo, it's a wraparound for your door. Um, just kind of gives you a little extra security there. Uh, we had a whole bunch of these. These sold on sale, $6.79 plus shipping. Screws are new, but I, I just, I can't tell. I think it looks brand new though. Yeah, it's, it's probably hard to tell too because I think on the outside it has a pull off thing. As long as it has that on it. I think it does anyway. I'm not sure. I can't get this thing out of here. That's crazy. Perfectly welded to this box. And who needs that to protect your door when you can just use the box to protect whatever you got? <laughs> but yeah, six seventy nine. That came from a big lock spy. We actually have a lot going out later here too. Um, I'll go work on the next thing there while Paul checks on that. Uh, next thing here is going to be these lithographs. You can see a giant stack of them here. Uh, this is going to be tough to do on camera, so I'm going to stop it right here and uh, get these all out because I got to grab one of each of these kinds here. That's good, right? Got the oh yeah, that's good to go. Okay, uh, I'm going to pause that and grab these real quick. Okay, I pulled them all out here. They're uh, these Disney lithographs. This is like a artwork from the movie. Each, each one of these sets has four different lithographs. Included were nine sets. Lady and the Tramp, Toy Story 4, Frozen 2, Cinderella, The Little Mermaid, The Lion King, Monsters University, Muppets, and we got Cars 2 there. Uh, individually, those don't have a ton of value, so I lotted up all nine of those. And this is the second set of nine to sell, $28 plus shipping. And you can hear the dogs fighting over Smurf butt. Here, Luna. And there they go. All right. Next thing here is in D24. We have a couple more Hold sets we can make up with those lithographs. Oh, another uh, memory maker camera here. I think this sold for about 14 free shipping. 14.99 free shipping. All right, nice. Next one's going to be in D6. It's over here. D6 is over there. Anyway. Hope you just ruined her childhood by. Oh, yeah. Saying that again. D6 right D6, there. D6, open it. And push this over and pull. I got it. Hello. Pull. I don't even know what We're this looking is. for a Barbie oh, watch. The watch. There it is. 
This one's called something, something the spotlight or solo in the spotlight. Uh, you can see it comes in a yes. little piano case there. I'll open it up real quick. All right, Fossil makes this watch here. It's still ticking. That's always a good sign because we did get a uh, just under five dollars per battery. Uh, this is a woman's watch. Comes with the paperwork and everything like that. It is brand new. You can see the tag behind it. We sold probably three of these. This one didn't have its outer box, but still sold for forty-three dollars plus shipping. I'm gonna put this whole thing back in that bag. Think you can do that? With the piano. Or do that. <laughs> Play some uh, tiny next dancer. Next is 13A. You just listed these. Um, oh, other, other side. side. All right, this is going to be a lot of eight Atari 5200 video games. They're actually in really nice condition. I'll grab this ch chunk here. Just not a lot of value at all. Um, here, Kenny, I'm going to go over your left shoulder here real quick. Yeah, just uh, we got Star Raiders, Pac Man. Uh, Missile Command, Defender, Super Breakout, Centipede, Galaxian, that one's label's a little crooked, and Pole Position. I wrote, these were untested, I wrote it right in the title. I don't have a system right now, and I don't really test Atari games anyway, they're just not worth it to me. Um, yeah, this lot of eight, so for $18.50 plus shipping. Next thing was that uh, Muppets ornament there, 1982 Miss Piggy and Kermit. I sold 15 free shipping on that. That's a little bit better. <coughs> as far as ornaments go. CC, we got a lot going out. This is it. Let me read you the thing. I already checked. You already checked? Yeah. Okay, we had a ton of locks. There's still... Let's see here. There's, I think, five, maybe seven. Some behind there. Um... <laughs> Tends to be, yeah, you see a couple more down in there. Look at all those locks right there. So we got we got a bunch of locks left, so it's always good when this goes out the door. Got one of these lever style locks. Uh, this is Dorma. This one sold for $21.24 on sale plus shipping. Next is a good puzzle. Yeah, that was nice. Uh, I think Got it's one. right here. Yep, I'm gonna move a couple things though. Okay, I gotta move some Spider-Man clocks. I think I can get it after that. Movie Queen, right? Yep, that's it. All right, Movie Queen, you see Marilyn Monroe, it has a bunch of other like women or dancers or something like that. I don't think this actually says Marilyn Monroe anywhere on the puzzle, but it kind of looks like her, so it was in the title. This is Movie Queens by Ron Cherenskin. You know, good old Ron Sharon skin. Sharon skin. <laughs> this is uh, 1972. I bet you Ron wishes he was Sharon skin with these ladies. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, sorry about the joke, but uh, yeah, that puzzle, brand new seal from 1972, 500 plus pieces, sold for 44 dollars plus shipping. So that's a great vintage puzzle sale. This next one's kind of a weird one. Um, Bottom D twenty four again. Yeah, when I when I built when when we built this, uh, I'm sorry. When my dad came over to do the electrical work, he wanted a bunch of these brackets right here. So when he ran the pipe, he could uh, kind of get it off the wall a little bit. Well, at first they sent me the wrong brackets. You can see how huge those ones are, and they're plastic. Um, I looked on the receipt when I came back from the place and they weren't even on the receipt. They're just like cheap little brackets anyway. And I didn't want to take the time to try to return them. Uh, this lot of 16, so for $13.50 with free shipping. I probably only make like $5 off of that because they are still pretty heavy, but I just had them. So I figured I'd list them. Not really something we bought to resell. I just happened to have them. <coughs> D18 here. Uh, this is a Star Wars. Saiz Watch your head. Tin. I think that's Yeah, I have it. no idea what Paul just said. S A E S E E. Saiz. That ain't him. That's not that. Come on. There it is right there. Okay. What? Saisi Tin. I don't know. Star Wars figure has a lightsaber, whatnot. 
Uh, this sold for nine dollars, free shipping. So we'll only make like four dollars on that or so. Um, here, let's get this back. What was this? D eighteen. Okay, and the last thing here is already pulled out. Oh, excuse me, honey. This is a Reed and Barton here. Uh, Reed and Barton, what is it? Oh, it's a 1976 Holly Ball Reed and Barton Silver Plated Ball. Just Christmas ornament. See it right there. $20 free shipping on that. So I was I'm happy. Surprised with these old Reed and Bartons that are popping up. Like the jiggers that you found, $20 balls. Like they're just silver plated. But well, and Allie, if you look them up. What was the other day? She sold the bell for like $25 yeah. free shipping, right? Look, yeah, you just got to look them up, I guess. Yeah, because we, we had like stashed a bunch of. We had stashed a bunch of Reed and Barton stuff down here. But they're like these little spoons and stuff. So you can see how many we have. There's a whole crap load of them. So yeah, we'll just keep, keep listing those as they come up. Yeah, but that's it for sales. Is that a couple more? A couple reading barns. I don't know what they are. Nice. I'm look them up. Um, that's it for the sales. Just shy of four, uh, 400. I wish it was 1400. Uh, pretty cool though. Between the watch, the puzzle, and the poster, they're all like 40, around $40 items. Those are pretty cool. We waited a long time for that post, uh, puzzle to go yeah. out. So that's it for the sales. I'm going to keep this one short. And uh, concise there, uh, get these shipped out, and then I got my work cut out for me because I got to get the house and the yard ready for this party. So uh, thanks for watching. Please comment, like, and subscribe, and uh, uh, get us up towards that 1,000 subscriber mark. I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Say Resell CNY. Resell CNY. Said please like and subscribe. Please like and subscribe. <laughs> Say thank you. Thank you. And bye. Bye. Bye, guys. Right. Thank you. Bye.